All right, I I've been proven right for the for the like third time now. I've told you guys it's not coming in the twenty second. We have a lot of news, as you can see. Rob Top came and he said a lot of stuff. This is what I was hoping for because we are really frustrated to know what's going on right now. So yeah, thank God he came, and we have some very very important news to talk about today. So let's start from the beginning. We have something about you know November. But we're gonna have to go into that in a little bit. All right, so he came. <laughs> How is my second favorite community? Like, come on, Rob. And he's been told what he's been doing, and he's just working hard on the update, as we all know. Okay, this was so funny. I'd like to request that you remain here until X Creator Gold comes <laughs> and finds out that you are here. And then he said, when he shows up, I will leave. But believe it or not, he answered like five or six of my questions, which is pretty cool. I'm so happy that he came today. Like, that was so important. I've asked him a very important question and I can't wait to see. Oh my god, people are... Okay, you guys are all in the video. Okay, here's the first important one. Do you think you will be able to make it in time? Unsure, to be honest. Server switch and bug fixing took much longer than I expected. Still trying, but there is a risk. I will have to push into November. Don't really want to, but at the same time, releasing something broken would be worse. I 100% agree. He's ha he'll have to see. Okay, here's the important question. Hey Rob, what do you plan to do if Steam or Apple doesn't accept your update? And he said very low risk of that happening, I think. Here he's talking about Steam and Apple. So Steam is computer and Apple is like iOS and stuff. Mac, something, I don't know. But it's not Android. Here we have somebody asking, what would be the major flaw if you did release it too early, to say? Probably broken gameplay elements. That will be pain if creators build levels. Oh my god, yeah, that's that's what I've been talking about. Like, if there is a bug, like a physics bug, for example, and people upload levels with that bug, you can no longer fix it. Just like the gravity flip switch, you know, where it's like has a lower gravity, I think. Yeah, that can no longer be fixed because so many levels use that bug to get through the level, you know. And that would be a huge issue if Robtob made that. So I'm gonna have to talk about what i think when it's gonna come out because now of course there are new information and yeah i'll just rush final parts of the level that make them subpar okay. yeah i don't think he's gonna release it too early like i told you guys he's gonna use his maximum time to finish to fix like all the bugs and in case he has more time he's gonna add explorers doesn't seem like the case yeah look at this here's when i appeared will 20 release on steam similarly i want to release it at the same time on all platforms this is what i said on my previous video and he did not change his mind however he could still do that because of my upcoming question <laughs> so here i asked him he still stayed after i came so which is pretty cool do you think you will have to release steam first then google play and he said normally no the only scenario where i would release steam or ios first is if google did for some reason some really picky stuff and was very slow like i told you guys google sometimes is really weird Sometimes it takes like a bunch of days and as we can see from now he is still not done. He's still fixing bugs like the update is it's just not done right. Which is why he's been saying that in case he is already finished with the update in October maybe Google might do some weird stuff and the mobile version would be delayed until November but the PC and the iOS would get it instantly you know in October. We're gonna have to see. Uh, let's see what he said. And he said here that usually iOS does not take that long. So I, I told you guys it takes like two days, maybe at maximum two days. I would say like iOS, Apple, like it's no problem. I think the only problem right here is with Google. And right here he said that Steam is going to be super fast. So in case he finishes 2.2, I believe that the Steam people are going to get it as fast as possible, which is why I said I'm going to make a Steam Geometry Dash giveaway. All you have to do is just slap that subscribe button. And once I, once I reach like 16,000 subscribers, I'm going to have to pick a winner. And if you want to win, you have to click the first link in the description. It's a video and you have to find a secret code in it. If you find it, just send it to me via like Discord or email or anything. And once you have sent that, I'm going to have to see if you won the giveaway or not. Okay, Steam giveaway. I'm going to do that. Oh my God, here I asked him something. Yeah, that was that was very interesting. I'm so scared that Google will reject it. It may take like seven days or something. That's what I talked about in the previous video. Like he's been answering a lot of questions. It's really helpful. Geometry Dash, the official version, does not have ads, apps, or external framework. So it's not that much to complain about. 
but it's Google, so who knows? Yeah, I told you guys, it takes seven days. Apparently, this is new information. Jumpy Dash, the full version, it should not take that long. You know what? Because usually the apps that take like seven days or longer are usually the apps that have like in-game purchases or ads because ads can be weird for like 13 year old and stuff. So they can be very picky with that. But we're going to have to see. And here he said that it's official version. So there are no ads whatsoever. So it should be it should be fine. I think it's going to be like a hopefully like Apple, maybe like two days or three days. We'll have to see like it's, it's, it feels like it's so close. How many players can new servers take? Not sure, but so far we were at peak time with zero issues. Okay, that's very good news. In case you didn't know, Robtop switched the servers a few days ago. And yeah, okay, that was interesting. <laughs> I really wanted him to like stream 2.2 while he's like clicking the release button because I think this is a legendary moment. And I asked him, is he going to stream it? And he said, I will sleep. I don't know. I think he's not having much sleep nowadays. So yeah, I have to what that's gonna play out have you given a limit of how many players can be online at once with the new service i tested the servers with load ux of old servers okay and i handled it without any problems yes let's go that basically means i think is that it's it's gonna handle a lot of players which is very good because as you guys know 2.2 is gonna come with such a huge new player wave like so many old players are gonna return and so many new players are gonna come, which is gonna be amazing Okay, this is, oh my god, look at this. The update very close to finishing. He said, it is very close. Just unsure if I will make it for October. But yeah, things have been going very well, except for the extra time with server and bug fixing. Yeah, being a game developer can be very difficult, especially because you can underestimate a lot of things. Like, I remember when I made my game, like, the closer it got to being finished the longer it took like it's ridiculous like it can be like delayed to a few months normal this is not talking about 2.2 i'm talking about like normal levels people would like underestimate the release date by a lot and especially because Robtop is like a indie game developer he works on his own so yeah no man it's really unexpected sometimes really like the new gameplay and new stuff so really looking forward to see what you everyone thinks okay i guess he's been having a lot of fun with 2.2 <laughs> recently bug fixing so did you switch servers or did you just fix some stuff on the other one he said he completely switched how many platformer levels are going to be in total i think there are going to be more than one two three four more than four that's for sure or actually maybe four more than three let's be. making platformer levels coming in 2.21 along with explorers so as you guys know explorers is delayed it's not going to come out great with 2.2 yes this is real information and it's not fake news so yeah the only main level that's going to come with 2.2 is going to be Dash, which is the first 2.2 sneak peek, and Explorers, which was initially the, you know, the 2.2 teaser, the song hint, basically. He said he's going to delay it until 2.21, and it's going to come with extra platformer levels. It's, it's going to be cool. Here I asked him if he is going to add more features to 2.21. Okay, 2.21. Or is it just going to be delayed stuff from 2.2? He said mostly delayed stuff uh, he also has some systems for like the auto build that's going to be very rough for 2.2 and then will be improved in 2.21 as far as the ui okay that's cool so the auto build is basically like you can have a layout and then you can like tell it i want to have this design and then you can like select the layout and click a button and then it automatically decorates the whole layout according to what you want you know this is like it's such a good tool i really like it it kind of reminds me of x turbo edit which is why i'm like i already know that i'm the and i'm gonna i'm gonna be the fastest guy to upload this video i already know it he yeah, asked him one more question no never mind that was an old one uh, how many days do you think uh point two explorers versus mode will come out depends how things go to be honest we will see we'll start working on them right away okay he, he just said that he's gonna sleep and now he's saying he's gonna wait like come on okay uh more stuff yes got so much news uh i'm gonna have to talk about the release date in a bit but let's just finish what he said wait where do we play the main platform level will there be route with the main levels or in a different area he said in a tower yes this is very known the tower is that thing that was shown i think in the second sneak peek or the third one i'm not quite sure but it's like a tower and it looks like a tower and it is a tower in fact how many new editor features are there going to be even just a rough estimate number would work yes okay that's i mean it's impossible to answer just like estimately as well you have to just yeah, i think this is like the perfect answer how to build sounds hype will scale trigger 
had it able to scale something above to scale. I don't have a limit right now. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Like, he doesn't have a limit right now. <laughs> okay. Okay, 2.2 is super unfinished. Oh no. Oh my god. Any plans on updating Geometry Dash on Amazon App Store along with... I don't know what these things are, but he said yes. So uh, it's going to come out on uh, different platforms as well. So you're feeling it for November? Question mark. There is a risk, yes. But working non-stop and we will see. Sometimes bugs show up that are demanding. Trying to use all the new systems in different platformer levels. And when I build real levels with features, sometimes bugs will show up that I have not seen before. This is a very common thing for game developers, especially for like level editors and stuff, because there are so many options that could happen. There are so many things that could happen, you know, like you can't calculate for everything. And this is, this is like the case for 2.2, of course. And it's just frustrating to me that these bugs are showing up right now i mean like it's kind of if you really think about it it's like good that they showed up because he's gonna fix them now but they should just not exist from the first place let's just put it that way one more question uh, if you finish okay this was oh my god i was so glad he answered this one if you finish 2.2 completely but google takes until november will you publish it on steam and he said no oh no 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 wait that was the wrong answer he said if Google delays more than a few days or declined, I will probably push the pl other platforms if they are ready. But I will let everyone know about progress. Thank God. This is what I've been wanting for like the past three videos. I've said I we need progress. We need to know what is going on right now. And thank God he came today and told us a lot of things. Uh, he said, I don't really like the idea of Android playing players saying update your game to play this level. And there is no update available. Okay, that would be very... Yeah, I understand. I don't know. So, yeah, that, that basically means if 2.2 is completely finished in October. And, okay, oh my god, this is so scary to say. But he might, like, only release it on all the platforms except for Google Play. Which is why I'm desperate to make this giveaway. I don't care. I want to make giveaway. I want to help you guys because you guys have been showing a lot of support. Like I said, I know I really want to pay back. So, yeah, he said... Yeah, he's going to see. I my god okay this this proves me right gamers i told you it's 99 I, I, no i said it's 100 percent confirmation it's not coming on the 22nd because of the beta branch update and now he confirmed that he said it's not gonna come out on the 22nd yes i was right for the um a trillionth time i think okay here we have someone asking uh oh wait who's this guy oh wait that's me uh yeah this guy asked is there a cl <laughs> look at this dude is there a glow shader in 2.2? And he literally tagged me, which is pretty cool. And I said, not as of 2022, because Robtop like leaked 2.2 accidentally in 2022. And the glow shader was not in it. So I added, maybe he will add it after. I don't know. And he said, nope. The edit color shader can give a strong color effect though. Okay, that's amazing. Like, I see that the, the shaders have a lot of, you know... A lot of a lot of variations that you can play around with so we're not gonna have repetitive looking levels which is amazing and to put in we're gonna have like very unique le looking levels i don't think we're gonna have like this very you know glowy style of like 2.1 i think this is gonna be i think this style is gonna die it's gonna rest in peace but we're gonna get like completely new looking stuff which is gonna be so exciting <laughs> oh my god this is sad how do you how much do you sleep these days nope um do you think the new servers are really gonna be enough for 2.2? I mean, it's a big update and a lot of people will instantly log on at once and play. And he said, hope so. Uh, yeah, that's just correct. A lot of people are gonna be playing 2.2. And I'm just gonna be so ridiculously happy about that moment. Uh, we're gonna have to talk about when that moment is gonna be in a bit. So we're gonna have to see. Uh, are they like bot servers or something? I don't know. It's not like I, I had... <laughs> okay, this is funny. He's just basically saying that he didn't make the service on his own with like sticks in the forest and stuff. Like a, like a Ooga Boogas thingy. Will the tower mode come out in the patch Rob top? No, the tower I think is available. Yeah, the tower levels are available right away with more stuff coming. Yes. Have some platformer levels. I won't have time to finish until 2.21. Okay, after 2.2... More 2.2 one news. <laughs> okay, we're gonna have so much news in the upcoming days. This is gonna be so cool. And also, 
It's it's kind of unbelievable that in like 20 days we will probably have 2.2 already, which is just mind blowing. And he said he's just building levels right now. Uh, we so hey Rob, I have a question. <clears throat> what number update do you think all the current plans ideas do you have in mind for the games will be finished? I could continue adding stuff to GD forever. There is no lack of area to improve and add. This is amazing. This is what's so beautiful about Geometry Dash. And it's just so cool to have such a creative game developer, I'm gonna have to say. And this is the last question that he answered. Do you think I can... Okay. <laughs> oh my god, what am I saying? I, dude, what was I thinking? I, I'm gonna have to read this out loud. Do you think I can copy some stuff to help you out in time? <laughs> Would be cool to have the community help in the last few days. And he said, the idea of the community helping is good. But some stuff like testing new features requires me to do it since I have the code and bug fix at the same time. Makes sense. Then when everything is somewhat tested, players can start going crazy with their new ideas. So he's basically saying there's no way to help him. I really wish there was because like it would be amazing to have like the whole community work together to finish the update in the, uh, at the time, you know. But apparently it's faster for him to do it, which is also understandable. So, okay, he said, oh my god, this is like the final message before we go into the 2.2 actual release date. So, his final message for today is, I'm ahead back to the grind. We'll see if I have to push to November or not. Really so sorry, one in it in October, but I'm doing my best. Okay, I guess, I, I, yeah, let's just talk about when I think it's gonna come out, because... There's some bad news. Oh no! <laughs> but, I mean, come on, like, come on, like everyone. Firstly, we have waited for six years. Okay, now waiting for another week. I would, bro. Like, if you tell me it's coming in January, I would not care. I mean, okay, maybe that's too much, but I, I really want to play this update, and we waited for so long. So if it gets delayed, for good, because if it gets delayed more bugs are going to be fixed. So the longer we wait, the better the update gets because we really don't want to have a broken 2.2. That would be devastating because in case you know, Counter-Strike has been updated to Counter-Strike 2 and the game was miserable. The game was so terrible. Like they tried pushing it as fast as possible. Just get it out there. I think like 10 minutes before the deadline, they released the, the update, the game, I mean, and it was so miserable. So I, I really don't want to have this same thing in 2.2 i think he should just take his time of course he should like speed run his way through developing the update but i do really think that we should not be very worried in case he's gonna delay it because like he's saying he might be having to delay it but it's for the good you know it's not gonna be kept promise perhaps maybe and even if not we're maybe just gonna get it in october but only on steam like there are three options either we get everything in october or we get steam only in october and the rest is going to be for november or we get everything in november which would be kind of interesting because if so there must have been so many bugs that roptop has not calculated for like i'm i'm really fascinated you can say by, by this situation i would say like if, you, if i was luis i would probably just say that this is the most zoinky situation to ever exist on this face of the planet so yeah like we know it's gonna be uh it's gonna be delayed i i i think let's put it out there okay let's i i i know a lot of people are gonna watch this video which is why i'm gonna have to put this out there please do not have your hopes for october because if you do you might be a little bit upset you might maybe maybe i'm not saying it is like i've heard okay this is annoying <laughs> i've told you guys it's not coming on the 22nd. I don't think so. And then some dude on the chat said, uh, Rob Top said he's not coming on the 22nd. He did not back then. Okay, so what I'm saying is, a lot of you guys are expecting the update to come out in October. However, from what Rob Top has said today, it seems like it is probably not going to be the case. However, it could still come out in October. I'm going to have to repeat this a hundred times. It may come out in October, it may not, but don't have your hopes for it in October. We're gonna have updates from Roptop, he's gonna keep us updated, he's gonna give us like progress updates, so it's gonna be cool. And in case we wait longer, it's gonna be for the better, like I said. So yeah, let me know what you think about this type of situation, because it's 
it's I don't know, it's fascinating to me. But I mean, to like, come on, if someone would have told you you have to wait ten days for two point two, the thing that you've been waiting for for like six years, what did you just say? Yes, like come on, we we need two point two, and we also don't want to have it broken. Like I would be so devastated. <laughs> opening steam and the game just crashes instantly like how oh, okay it's not going to be like that but there are going to be similar bugs to that so yeah i guess this is the end situation maybe i mean we're gonna get more news i really okay first thing let's just put huge respect to rob for keeping us updated like that like he's answered so many really important questions today i want to put it out there and yeah I I wish I could support him. I could help him with something, but he said it's better and faster for himself to do that. So yeah, I'm gonna have to accept that as well. Uh, he's trying his best. So yeah. So yeah. Um, I will see you guys in the next video because I'm sure there's gonna be so much news soon so yeah giveaway make sure to click the link in the description if you don't have geometry dash on steam because it may come out first before the mobile version so make sure to click the link and search for the code it's a video it's a full cool video you just have to search for a code okay i will see you guys in the next video have a good day okay wait no that was that was bullsies ending okay uh, yeah bye bye